Savage W MMA fan. That's why she ain't selling pay per views. You know what I mean? Look at the fifth round. I enjoyed the fifth round. That's when it was like, yeah, here we go. Why, why not this at the first round? Shevchenko said that she had a while to figure out the, the spirit of the cage. But like, I know it just looked like she started throwing in the fifth round and nothing really else, to be honest with you. But yeah, fifth round was good. Every other round was fucking shit. So um, that's my opinion on the fight. There you go. See how that one goes down with the MMA community. Because that was absolutely shit. Rounds one through four, terrible. There's no way you convince anyone that they're the best fighters in the world if they watch that. If I showed my my friend who doesn't know MMA rounds one through four, first of all, he'd be unconscious by the end of it because he'd be asleep. Or he'd be angry at me telling me to change it over and why are you making me watch this shit? I, I don't know why I did it to you, but I'm sorry. Please stop making me watch this. And then if I told them afterwards, hey, that's the best woman in the world, by the way. Crazy, man. So this is me, the MMA girl, saying this. Shevchenko, you had a shit performance. It was boring as fuck. You need to change that, and you need to do better next time. Okay? I'm going to start treating the women like men, because that's the only way they're going to get as good as them. The women's strawweight division get held to that standard, and they achieve that standard. But it seems like everyone else is fucking their game to just hug. So fuck him. Shevchenko, you did shit. You know, folks, where would the online world be without its Valentina Shevchenko haters? I mean, really. I mean... I, I guess the, the online WMMA universe, it, I guess it wouldn't be balanced out without its fucking haters. All of the shit that this person said in this video, <laughs> and no, I will not leave a link to this fucking video, was just straight garbage. This is not a hardcore fan. This is not a casual. This is somebody in the middle who, they, they like MMA, you know, they even fuck with the women. They watch it. They may even pay for it. But they don't really understand how this shit works. And, and to be honest, I don't give a fuck if they do. Because, you know, to shit on such a great champion, you know, is ridiculous. You know, and, it, and say, well, these people are just simps. What the fuck ever? These are people who appreciate greatness. So if you don't appreciate greatness in all of its facets and all the ways it comes together, you know... You're talking about a woman that if she was able to go down the straw weight would absolutely decimate the whole division. Okay? I love Rose Nami Nunes. And she will be, hopefully, the next new second time straw weight champion. But when she sparred with Valentina, she was left with a fucking black eye. She earned that fucking black eye, but she was left with a black eye nonetheless. You know what I'm talking about? So this goofy motherfucker right here, I think he's a guru. I don't know what the fuck he is. It looked like somebody took... A, a, a bunch of snow and it gets made in the shape of a boulder and set on top of a, of a fucking neck. I mean, this motherfucker looks like a fucking snowman rocking a toboggan. Big, white, puffy face. Just this dude, this dude, he knew he was being an asshole, you know? I, I don't like that shit. You don't, you, you don't try to talk more shit than the savage. Because first of all, you don't even know what the fuck you're talking about. Talking about how, yeah, you know, the men, they would stand them up. They wouldn't leave them on the ground like that that long. They wouldn't let them do that. I mean, if, if, if Usman did this and he wouldn't do that, Usman gets shit all the fucking time for being a wrestler. A lot of people accuse, accuse Usman of fucking uh, being a motherfucker who don't do enough shit for excitement. Usman eats shit. Tyron Woodley, who you mentioned, talking about, yeah, Dana booed him. Dana's fucking crazy. Dana got more space in his head than the, than the fucking black. Who gives a fuck what Dana says, okay? Dana's the same motherfucker who, when they asked him, do you read books? This motherfucker said, no, I don't read books. Books are stupid. I want you to think about that. This is a motherfucker who runs a billion-dollar organization. Yes, he's smart enough to run this shit. Yes, he has his qualities. But that don't mean he don't have his fucked-up qualities, too. And here's my bigger point, because let me just get to my motherfucking point. At the end of the fucking day, like I said in your comment section, which I'll never go to ever again, you are a motherfucking hater. Valentina Shevchenko will end her career as a champion. She will end her motherfucking career with a clear face, with barely any scratches on it, no lumps, million dollars in a fucking bank, with a brain that works fully functional. And you'll just be online spewing hate and sadness because you didn't see enough violence. You didn't see enough of people getting hurt and destroyed. What well, again? You're not into martial arts. You're into pure savagery. You just want to see a motherfucker get beat up like you're watching old tapes of bum fights and shit. You know what? You know what I'm saying? You sound like a fucking loser. This is the motherfucking champ of the fucking world, and us as Team Bullet fans will stand up for it no matter what. We will keep defending it against you and your bullshit. Motherfucker, you ain't no damn guru. You fucking garbage. This is Savage W MMA fan.
All hail the queen.